What's up guys, we're back for another episode of Stein's Gate, where Kurisu's dead now. So what's the point of living? <laughs> not gonna lie, I think she was my favorite character, so it kind of sucks that she's not gonna be here anymore. I mean, I still have faith that maybe they find a way to like change the world line so that she could still be alive. Hey, I just hope so. But, you know, since they deleted the database and it did change the world line, I'm just wondering what their next goal is. Well, it is almost the end of the season, so it's probably just gonna be like an aftermath of what happened. So, let's just get into the episode. Wait, World War 3? What? Wait, is he talking with Amane? Uncle? <laughs> what? Is he just tired of it already? Yeah, nobody knows who Kurisu is. Oh, wait, they do? Go back to 2010? Wait, wait, prevent her death? Oh, shit, yo, there's a chance? Wait, how does she know about that? Oh, so it's just a theory? Shit, is he actually gonna go? He's probably gonna go. I mean, she did say that her mission is to save Kurisu. Oh, she's very important. Yeah, it's not just save Kurisu. I mean, you're preventing World War Three. Yeah, but he cares about Kurisu, right? Alright, he's doing it. Yeah, that's right, Daru. <laughs> Wait, when they go back, they can't go back to the present, right? So what, they're just gonna live their life in the past? Wait it out? Wait, wait, they could go to the future? Oh shit, I guess a lot of things did change. Alright, we're finally gonna see this thing in action. Oh. And it disappeared. Fragments of time? Oh shit. Oh, yo, it's the thing that happens when you like time leaps. What the? Oh, I thought someone was shooting them. What even caused the stabbing though? I mean... Dude, he is so close to his past self. I mean, this is pretty dangerous. Shit, it's Kurisu. Come on, don't act weird, man. Don't ruin it. Compose yourself. Come on, stop acting weird, man. Yeah, that was weird, man. Oh, it's... She didn't get that creeped out. Yeah, I want to know who the hell stabbed her. Oh wait, she was actually listening? Well, maybe she wasn't stabbed there. Maybe she was stabbed somewhere else and they just threw her body in that room. Alright, well this is the moment where she came to this room. She's reading papers on a time machine? Oh shit, is that the guy? Wait, her father? You gotta be kidding me, dude. Was he so pissed off that it 
and jealous that his daughter would make this time machine? Kicked out? Oh yeah, he got a terrible personality. No wonder he got kicked out. Don't tell me he killed her so he could take the credit. Man, what a piece of shit. He really did do that. What the hell, dude? This freaking bitch. Oh my god, this guy is insane. Come on, where's Kyoma? Come on, beat his ass. What the, what the hell is this guy saying, dude? Oh shit, yo! Dang, this guy is crazy! Oh no, man, there's a screwdriver right there? Oh no! Oh shit, good! I think he's exaggerating a bit. <gasps> no. What? Uh, they can go back and undo this, right? Man, this piece of shit. What the? Great. Now he has to go through Kurisu dying a lot. All right, well, it looks like they need to do a do-over. Great. Just when we thought he was recovering from Mayuri, man, this happens. Wait, but do they have enough fuel? Look, calm down. You'll be back later. Yeah, don't give up. I guess he doesn't want to go through, through that all over again. Turn on the TV? Wait, who's that? What the hell? How did he get it? Oh, that paper he stole? Oh, shit. Great, so it was Kurosu's stupid father. Nah, don't start talking like that. At least try. How's he accepting this so easily? Hey, but he ended up saving Mayuri, right? Nah, you can't blame him for being broken, though. He did go through a lot of shit. Yeah, I'd be tired, too. Oh, oh right, yeah, if there's anybody who can talk sense into him, it's her. Yeah, come on, this isn't like you, Kyoma. Don't give up, man. We all want Kursu alive. Oh, what? Wait, how does failing let him see this video, though? What the hell is that? What? Oh, shit. So it was necessary for him to fail? To feel this pain? Enter Stein's gate? What does that mean? Alright, yeah, destroy that. Because it caused a whole bunch of problems. Uh, it doesn't sound that hard, does it? Why? What? Approaching it incorrectly? 
Then how is he going to save her? Oh. Oh, that's what she said. Yeah, but how does that help? How's he gonna do that? The final mission? Alright, this sounds like it's gonna be hard though. <laughs> Alright, true. Deceive your past self. Alright, so. How many tries is it gonna take this time? <laughs> I would seem like he got his inspiration back. Alright, good. Oh, that's right. Yo, I'm getting hyped up now. Yeah, come on, say it, man. Scream it out loud so everyone can hear this. Crap, wait, is it over already? So there's a chance to save Kurisu. So it seems like this final operation has two important parts. The first one is to basically destroy the file that involved all the time machine information. Because who would have thought that Kurisu's own father stole that shit and then stabbed his own daughter just so he could take the credit? I mean, see, I know Kurisu said that he would get pissed because his daughter was smarter, but this is too much. I mean, this guy's straight up a piece of shit. He caused World War III. But yeah, the first part is to get rid of those papers because apparently it takes him to Russia. And when everyone finds this out, then that's how World War III started and a whole bunch of people died. If you think about it, that's what's important. If they get rid of that, then World War III won't happen. But Kyoma wants to save Kurisu. And it seems like to do that, he's gonna have to deceive his past self. Almost like if Kyoma was just like the key part to changing the world line. Which is pretty weird because you're not actually undoing her death. You're just making one guy think that something happened when it didn't. That's pretty weird how that can change the future. I don't even know how future Kyoma came to that conclusion, but it seems like that video really got him excited and now he really wants to help Kurisu, which is good because it seemed like he was already given up, he already felt hopeless. Then of course my Yuri, you know, gave him a little talk, a little slap, and then with the video of his future self, that got him back to his normal self. So I'm not sure if this mission to save Kurisu and prevent World War III is gonna happen next episode or next season because i don't know how long it'll take hey but i'll see you guys there and i hope you guys stick around